Greetings to all. On this day, my company has launched a fresh accessory exclusively crafted for the IQ version, namely an air assistance kit. This kit aids us in maintaining the cleanliness of wood or other materials edges while cutting without leaving any undesirable yellow burn marks. Now, let us proceed to unpack and examine the inventory of this particular accessory. This is a basic honeycomb board that we require for the purpose of cutting, with a damp structure that enables smoke to be lifted away from both surfaces during the process. This is an expertly crafted air bubble breathing tube that is specifically designed for use in specialized airways and provides optimal airflow and comfort. It's the air nozzle that connects to the laser cutter. as well as some installation accessories. Um, now let's start by removing the top cover of the IQ case. Okay, let's install this kit. It comes with three power options, 3W, 5W, and 10W. To achieve better cutting results, we'll install the 10W laser today. First, you need to open the protective panel of this laser. After opening it, you can observe that there is a circular pit on this side of the laser and it fits quite well. Then, we require to include an anti-slip electronic component. Yes, proceed here. Then there are threads located on top of this. We proceed to tighten the nut after carefully placing it in the designated position. Move the air tube to the side tightly in that position. Next, let's proceed to install this air pump and air tube. I currently have two color codes on the machine. One is for the, um, the root, and the one above is for the intake pipe. After taking it out, there is a black socket on the motherboard on my end. Afterward, we can proceed by connecting one end of the air tube to the side where the air nozzle was just attached in the previous step. On the other side, we got an air pump. After that, we carefully place the laser into the slider. Don't forget to tighten the fulcrum nut. Next, tidy up the wires. Make sure to place these shoes on the far right, leaving enough length for a clean and organized look. We move to check if there are any threads under the maximum formation of the laser. Three zero. The 
The accessories have been installed. Now, before cutting, let's ensure safety by restoring the machine's top cover. This, then we have this professional honeycomb board, positioned perfectly right in the center of the workspace. Next, we will conduct a test to evaluate the cutting effect when using the air bubble box without utilizing air bubbles.